Hey guys, Nancy Robbins back. Today I'm going to make a video of an overview of how my first week was uh, post-surgery. Um, and then if you have any questions or whatnot, you can leave them on the bottom and I'll answer it if I did not cover it. So on Wednesday, I had the surgery. They instructed me just to go home and relax, stay up with the ice. They gave me two ice packs, um, reusable ice packs to use, and sent me home with a pain medication prescription and to just stay up on that and I so the pain doesn't get overbearing. Um, didn't really have a whole bunch of pain that day. Uh, couldn't sleep very well that night. Um, the following day, Thursday, the pain had decided to show up and it was extensive. The pain hurt. I definitely had to keep an ice on. Um, had to keep up with pain medications. Had to keep up with a muscle relaxer. Um, I couldn't move around much. I had to have help getting up, moving, trying to get it comfortable. Um, I couldn't sit. Um, I was a once I was able to get up and walk, I could use the restroom with not very much problems. But you know, I had to have help sitting down on the toilet or being able to put my arm enough so that I could help myself on and off. Um, had to have help with you know pulling the pants back up, that kind of thing. Um, in regards to eating and drinking, I ate stuff that was not messy because that would have been impossible to clean up. My drinks, I made sure that I had straws in them because I couldn't lift them up to be able to put them to my mouth and get the liquid out of the can. <clears throat> so I made sure I had straws. Um, I had to have help with everything. That was... Um, day two and day three, same thing. It was bad. It hurt to move. It hurt to sit. It hurt to try to lay. Um, thank God for my family because I had, my kids were helping with cooking, uh, helping with me, helping to get me stuff. My husband was a tremendous help after he got out of work, um, my daughter helped me get dressed, helped me clean up. I could take a shower after two days, which I was surprised about. Um, I did not have staples. I did not have outside stitches. All I had was the glue, the surgical glue and the steri strips. And then on top of that, I had um, a bandage with foam, which I'll insert pictures in here. I have pictures of what it looked like right after surgery. Um, I have pictures of after the outside bandage came off, and then I also have pictures of when the steri strips came off. So you can see the differences. Um, and I had no appetite. I did not feel like eating. My family tried to enforce it on me that I needed to eat, but I just was not hungry. Um, day four, that wasn't quite so bad. Um, four and five, I still needed help with a lot of stuff. I still couldn't get soft dressed. Um, I still couldn't get up and get anything to eat for myself, but to lay or to sit was a little bit easier pain wise. Um, I just, I stayed on the ice machine, did what I needed to do. Um, I also made sure that I had loose fitting clothes, button up shirts, uh, zip up sweatshirts, um, loose pants, um, and I could not sleep in bed. I had to sleep on the couch. Excuse that, that was my neighbor. Um, and I slept on, I've slept on the couch the whole time so far. That's the only way I could get comfortable. Uh, lots of pillows, blankets for cushioning. 
and if you have long hair, make sure that you have somebody to help you with it because I could not brush it. I could not do anything with it. Um, my husband helped me. My daughter helped me. My future daughter-in-law helped me. Um, so just keep that in mind also. So you won't be able to cook. You won't be able to get any food for yourself. You won't be able to get dressed for at least the first while, the first week. Um, I had a lot of help with, um, I can't think of anything else in particular. Um, my shower was very difficult. I had to have help getting in and out of the tub. My husband helped me with all of that. Um, helped clean my back, my hair, helped me get out, you know, all that yucky stuff. Don't want to talk about it, but. I do. So if you have any other questions or comments, put them down below. Otherwise, like and subscribe for more information. My second week update will be coming up soon. Thanks, guys.